got another one for y'all this morning. That's a false flag. Probably been hearing that in relation to Ukraine lately. Um, and they don't teach it in the school. So maybe we should talk about what is a false flag attack. Um, the origin origins of the term go back to pirate ships flying the flag of a country to approach another vessel and they would think that they're friendly forces and then at the last second they attack. Um, it kind of shifted over the years to mean something a little bit different where you would attack your own country or your own people <clears throat> and then blame it on a foreign actor to give yourself an excuse to go and attack that group or people. Um, one of the one of the first big ones was the Reichstag fire, which helped get Hitler gain power. Um, so basically, they set fire to the German Parliament building, blamed the enemies, the communists in this case, and then used that as an excuse to purge the country of communists, even though they didn't really do it. Um, another big one is in 1953, uh, the U.S. and Great Britain organized a coup in Iran, um, where they bombed mosques, and then said it was the nationalists. I don't know. I'm probably getting this one wrong. But anyways, it happens all the time. Uh, there's Operation Northwoods, which you can look up. Thankfully, JFK didn't go through with it, but the plan was to blow up a airplane full of American citizens over Cuba and then blame the Cubans as a pretext for invasion. Um... There's also the Gulf of Tonkin incident, where, which led to Vietnam, where they fired on their own vessel, or maybe there was no firing at all, but they said that the Viet, Viet Cong were shooting at them when actually there was no shooting, or maybe they were just shelling an empty island. Either way, we'll never really know the details because this is all conspiracy fact, um, which means we get a little thread of evidence here and there that can be proven, but we'll never know the full details because it's a secret. Um, obviously 9-11, pretty, pretty big one there. U.S. attacked their own buildings as an excuse to go to Afghanistan. Um, so throughout history, this happens. And the point here is whenever there's a major event and then an instant call to war, you should probably be suspicious that maybe the government did it to themselves.